born to be free guys that's bitcoin good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you are in this beautiful world whenever you're watching this video welcome to the bitcoin family youtube channel and for the newcomers my name is didi tayutu and yes i am the guy that with his family three daughters and a wife sold literally everything they owned five years ago went all into bitcoin and started traveling the world now coming to you from playa de carmen in mexico yes i will be making some mistakes i'm a dutchy not native english speaking it's terrible to be busy but in a good way uh, talking today about bitcoin blockchain and life. I have this new four hour job that I drew this morning that I want to share with you that you can see what my next target is in Bitcoin. Also some other charts that are supporting that. Then we are going to take a look at the BAM BAM indicator, the profits we made yesterday with trading. We are going to take at the news a short look at the news and maybe end it again with uh, the family stuff and talking about my mindset of life because yesterday a lot of people loved the last part of the video where I talked about how we created this mindset and how we live this life as a family coming from, from a rooftop terrace in Playa del Carmen Tulum beautiful place let's jump into the charts guys the first chart the four hour chart that will show you the direction my opinion Bitcoin is going. Let's go there with the same way we always do. Bam! That I drew this morning, guys. This is a really cool chart. I'm going to do it like this. This is, in my opinion, the way we are moving at the moment. At the moment, we had this ABC correction, and it's the Elliott waves, and now we form the one, two, three, and now we are forming the fourth wave, and now we are going into the fifth wave. The target of this fifth wave, guys, in my opinion, is around 77,000 US dollars somewhere near that area it depends on which chart you draw these um, channels and these lines this is on the bybit chart if you draw this on the bitmic chart or on the bitfinex chart you, you will get a little bit different number but still i think 70k a little bit above 70k should be our target and like you can see yes we are forming this yeah, wedge Tri triangle where we need to break out so um, this bottom line have, has been supported every time higher low higher low oh wait I will do it like this higher low higher low creating a higher low have yeah. higher high higher high where is this next higher high going to be in my opinion uh, you can also have the sub waves counted but in my opinion this new target should be somewhere in the top of this channel that we have been moving in if we take a look at the bam bam indicator we can see that one over here you can see here on the left in the screen bam bam and um, if we take a look at the bam bam indicator we can see we are acting now around the 38 level the 38 level you can see that on the right of the screen the white number that's a 38 level that's the level of this white line every time when this blue line is crossing the bottom red line and then the white line we will see a bullish flag appear a long flag i mean appear on the uh, charts if you bought the bam bam indicator this is a sign that we are going to go long this line on 38 is a very low number be aware the last time we were at the same level of 38 here this level wow this level was here and from that moment we touched the bottom of that channel and then from that moment we went up, we went up to the high point of the, the white line here and that high point was around 72 the price jump we made because of this was let's see we go back here here the price was 40 uh, 44000 and we went to the high of 61000 that was a 18 17 18000 dollar increase in value of price of bitcoin because we moved from the level of this white line of 38 to the level of 70. 
we are again at a 38 level if we would grow with this white line back to that 72 level then it would be easy reachable for us to go from 55k the level we are now at the moment to the level that we showed you above 77k that's only a 20k jump so that 20k jump we already did it the last time when we moved from here to there so now we are down here again if you're moving up again this is reachable so the bam bam indicator is telling me the same um, the same i can see here margin call two we are seeing the yellow which means bearish but the yellow starts to decline you can see the turn over there starting again if the yellow starts to decline and becomes green again this green candle that is now forming on the top of the chart will be a bigger green candle the TikTok is at the moment still bearish as well i'm just trying to you know you can see we are still bearish but you can see in the TikTok as well the last time we were that bearish in the, in the bottom you know we are reversing and then we get a bull sign and then we can go long again sorry that the charts are so small i'm doing this all on my iphone uh, maybe i should be doing this on the laptop next time uh, but i like to be outside when i record these videos so this is the bigger picture i am looking at and with this bigger picture in my mind i do the short-term trades on bitcoin and that is what i'm going to show you now let's jump into this chart um this one uh, this one is first also important this one is showing me and the bitcoin supply is moving off exchanges we can see a lot of bitcoins moving from the exchanges to hardware wallets i think it was the largest daily drop in the last six weeks and on the other hand we can see tether going into the exchanges so probably um, they will be buying the bitcoins and um, the bam bam indicator that is the chart that i want to show you this is what we did yesterday we traded 500 dollar one percent of the bitcoin price a leverage of 10 and we created out of the 500 dollar 866 us dollar yes we only did two trades the short in the morning 6.3 percent with a leverage almost 60 percent and here uh, 0.6 percent with a leverage of 10 6 percent so that's converting 500 dollar into 866 us dollar you can see the short over there that was a very clear short we saw a short flag then the red candle was closing down below the yellow stepping line at the same time the bam bam indicator was crossing downwards on the white line that's the blue line crossing downwards on the white line at the same time we saw the green decreasing and even some yellow appearing that is the sign that's a triple confirmation you need to take that short then a little bit later in the afternoon um, there was a long flag appearing we saw the long flag over there we saw the candle close above the yellow stepping line even though we went down for some time we went up again so that would still be a profitable sh uh, profitable trade but only like 0.6 percent with the leverage uh, six percent but also there the candle was closing above the yellow stepping line the bam bam indicator the blue line was crossing the white line and yes the blue was um, disappearing there was a green dot appearing on the red line and yes we saw green appearing above that dot so that means all these indicators told me take the long so this is how we traded the profits with the bam bam indicator some other charts that are really important at the moment this chart uh, nobody will understand anything about this chart i will try to explain it it's friday the 26th of march we will have a lot of options expire i think it's like 6.81 billion dollar in options every time when these quarterly options expire we see a huge move in bitcoin the last two times we saw those quarterly L options expire we saw a run of respectively 88 percent in september and 150 percent after december so now the 26th of march again these options will expire 6.1 billion will we repeat history the 25th of september they expired we saw an 88 percent increase of the price the 25th of december they expired we saw a 150 increase of the price now the 26th of march the first quarter 
that it's going to expire, will we, ex say, ex will we again see this huge increase in price? Maybe just the average of like 150 and 90 is 240, maybe we will only see a 120% increase, all possible. Very important. Here, another one. This is like a one day chart. On this one day chart, you can see exactly, you know, what we are doing. We are moving inside this uh, uh, pennant and, and we can go to uh, the upper line or we can go to the bottom line. Um, I think the numbers are a little bit more uh, clear on this one. You know, these are the levels of support, the EMA 50, the EMA 100, the EMA 200. I don't think we will go below the EMA 100 at the moment. Um, the 200 is around 52K. You know, it's all possible. Uh, you know, we have two options go up to 76 now in the short term or go down these are all um, charts that i look in the daily very important news guys this is one of the best news for me today the family token is one of the top gainers on coin gecko we are back we are back we are back at 41 dollar cents we fell down to nine cents because of the heck of tri roll tri roll handled everything perfectly and they added back the volume and the liquidity and we are back at 40 cents thank you tyrol for try roll for that i'm going to come back to that later guys in the video the bitcoin monthly returns we can see that march is in history has been a red month a negative month i already made this video a month ago they said oh next month could be and like you can see, the only month that was positive, uh, green, was 2013 the bull run, 170% plus. But 2017 the bull run, we had a minus 12. So now, 2021, we can still have a red month or a green month. But, you know, the upper hand of the March months in those years was negative. Let's see what will happen. Um, this is about the family token pair. You can see the dollars, forty-two dollar cents back, and uh, we are back at the three hundred and thirty thirty-four thousand um, liquidity. Yes, beautifully, the family is back, and that is bam no for video DD, and that is very beautiful. Yes. I sat down because if I want to talk to you in a quiet, lazy, easy way, I need to sit down. But the family token is back to 40 cents. I want to congratulate everybody that bought a dip at 9 cents. You, uh, you made like a 500% return. Congratulations with that. I want to thank all the family members out there that they didn't sell the family tokens at that dip that you still kept believing in me that you still kept believing in the huge vision of the bitcoin family and that you still kept believing in tri -roll, solving all these issues they did they did in a perfect way thank you the whole tri -roll theme for solving and uh, being calm and making this happen again and baking the bitcoin family back to the level taking it back to the level where we were before uh, that was all the charts now let's jump quickly into the news part i have some short news that i need to tell you as well because the news uh, makes a whole package that you wake up in the morning and you see the charts you read the news and that is when you start to trade let's jump into the news part this part bam the first news guys this they're going to auction the first ever nfts this is so cool it's going to be done by time is god dead is truth that is fear that these will be auctioned i'm i'm you know i want to see how how large the um the sales will be i i think this nft world is going crazy and uh, you know let's see if the, what, what will happen i think this is going to be a huge price that people are going to pay for this but let's see that's very positive news uh 2.99 million was also paid for the first ever tweet of jack dorsey this is all about nfts you know there's millions of dollars now being paid for nfts so this one 2.9 million how much do you think that time is going to auction their nfts this is huge news telecom operator this is negative news sky global charge for laundering millions using cryptocurrencies yes you can use cryptocurrencies to launder money but like only one percent of the cryptocurrency is used for that the rest is used in a positive way just compare it to fiat how much fiat is used for money laundering and all that stuff that's like 
and maybe even 30% of the fiat, I think. So uh, don't be concerned about Bitcoin or other cryptocurrencies being used for money laundering because it has always been done by dollars and euros as well. Tether managed to print 20 billion this quarter. This is insane. They have now a market cap of 40 billion, making it the fourth largest cryptocurrency under Bitcoin and Ethereum and BNB. This is huge. Um, US dollar Tether is growing tremendously. And yes, of course, this is needed because when Bitcoin grows, when more people buy Bitcoin or exchange Bitcoin to a stable coin, they will often use US dollar state, uh, Tether. Really positive news. Here, another cool news. Mm, I need to click OK here so you don't have that one. Um, sorry here bitcoin mining uh, they are going to be listed on the nasdaq yes this is what is happening now with crypto companies they are being listed on the, uh, official you know nasdaqs and all that stuff so yes it is being integrated into the normal financial systems it, it is not considered as multi-level marketing again it's not considered as a scam it's considered as official companies that now can be listed on um, the Nasdaq, for example. Huge news, of course. Uh, not for decentralization, but yes, news for Bitcoin mass adoption. No, Bitcoin is no longer dead. No, Bitcoin has indeed already been giving up for that at least 400 times. But the reality is that it's more alive than ever. That is what the Deutsche Bank says now. So yeah, also the Deutsche Bank declared Bitcoin for that almost 200 times. But now they need to agree, ah, nah, it is not that. Um, it is probably going to be the 21st century of gold and that is why we are going to offer um, all that stuff as a custodial service as a bank now in bitcoin man they are going to kiss your asses they are going to try to buy your bitcoins in any kind of way in every kind of way so make sure you huddle your bitcoins till bitcoin goes over a million or something and then maybe 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 think about selling it to one of these banks um this is not some good news. Uh, they say they could go lower than 53k. You know, I just saw, showed you the charts. I believe. I don't believe it. I believe that we bounce and that we go up. Um, but that's my opinion. Uh, the U.S. miner block cap plans to have a 40,000 ASICs operational by quarter four. That is the last news that I'm going to talk about. And I'm going to do that again on screen, like this. Bam! With my face in screen because i think that the whole mining war still needs to get started do you understand how big this war will be do you know that every country in the world wants to become the biggest miner the united states wants to be the biggest miner um, europe wants to be the biggest miner china wants to be the biggest miner pakistan iran iraq venezuela all countries want to be the biggest miner why would they want to be the biggest miner because Bitcoin will be the 21st century of gold and every country wants to be involved in this new monetary system that is going to be backed up by the 21st century of gold. And this is why the United States and all these US based companies are now upgrading and adding miners because then they have like 1% of the total Bitcoin mining um, capacity of the world. China still is the biggest, but we need to start somewhere. And all these countries will add miners and even give permission to their power plants like they are doing in Iraq, like they are doing in Pakistan. We have seen the news even published by Reuters. Pakistan is incentivizing their power plants to mine bitcoins, which means all countries in the world will slowly move towards mining bitcoins with their power plants, which will create a mining war. And that is how important bitcoin is already considered for the future monetary system. Because, because else these countries will not even think about having their power plants mine bitcoin. It's going to be bigger than we can imagine. It's going to be bigger than we even can think of at the moment. We are thinking in 100k, 200k Bitcoin prices. We, I think we slowly need to start thinking about 1 million dollar Bitcoin prices, maybe even 5 million dollar Bitcoin prices in the far future when we evolve as humanity and when we start to work and live together with the evolution of this technology, of the monetary system and we are creating a revolution of this monetary system because we are taking the power back to the people and that is exactly what you need to do. If you mon minimize your monthly fixed 
cost by selling your house, by selling all the stuff, all that baggage on your back. If you sell that stuff, you can step out of the traditional monetary system and become more easily part of this new monetary system that we are building uh, on the blockchain with artificial intelligence in a decentralized way where you don't need to own a house anymore. You don't need to own a car anymore. You don't need to own all that shit anymore because it will be provided to you as own entities probably built on a blockchain project and you can just use them whenever you want, wherever you want, and how often you want, wherever in the world. That is how a decentralized future will look. You will be walking out of a house that you paid with your bitcoins for the time you spent in that house. You don't own the house. You will be walking onto the street. There will be a self-drivable car that has a Bitcoin wallet, you step into the car, you tell the car, drive me to that place, the car will drive you to that place, you will pay with your wallet, the car uh, will repair itself with that wallet, if it needs to be repaired, it will drive to a garage and will repair itself, it will be repaired by artificial intelligence, robots that will fix the car, it will be an own entity on the blockchain, all that is going to happen in the future. We don't need to own that shit anymore. We can just use the lending, my lending economy, all that decentralized solutions that we are building as a community, we will be using that. Our kids will be using it. Why we as a family are leading by example for our kids. You don't need to have the house anymore. You can use it. We will have universal basic incomes, all that stuff coming in. The world is changing very quick and if you want to know more about this or more discuss about this or want to be become be part of this huge bitcoin family that we are building then please go to the links down below this video click on the links and go to the discord server you will be there surrounded with 3000 family members that are talking about bitcoin blockchain and life every day even if you always want to know the first steps in trading we will help you if you want to have the first steps if you want to have the first steps in changing life we will help you all that stuff is happening at the bitcoin family discord server make sure you sign up if you want to trade the bam bam indicator and all the other stuff if you want to start trading please use our referral links down below this video the bybit link will give you a 90 dollar bonus uh, the dudex link a 300 dollar bonus the prime xbt link a 50 percent deposit bonus all these links when you use them and start to trade with our links we make some fees those fees go into a fund those that funds are going to be used to help poor people all over the world that is what the Bitcoin family is about and that is exactly what the new website, thebitcoinfamily.com, will soon be showing you guys. That was everything for today. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy the video, please give the video a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell and please leave a comment as I love to respond to your comments. Always remember to zoom out in Bitcoin and to zoom in at life. Try to enjoy every single minute of the day as that should be exactly what life is about. Thanks for watching. <clears throat> My throat is a little bit dry now from the talking too much again. Um, and hopefully see you tomorrow again. We are going to go on a day trip today with the family. Probably I can add those videos to tomorrow's videos. So make sure you watch this one and tomorrow one as well. And all the other ones we promote on YouTube, of course, as well. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I wish you an amazing day and hopefully see you tomorrow again. Bye.